Panthers trying to reverse the script. The Mountaineers have won the last five meetings, and we are underway here in Pittsburgh. An early three-point attempt right off the bat good from Eric Stevenson. He is back at West Virginia after spending last year at Washington. Down in the post. Bell got the shot off. Burton working on Stevenson. Pull up from the elbow. Jamarius Burton in his second season with Pitt after coming over from Texas Tech. Three ball good by Eric Stevenson. His second of the night already. Nice move. Couldn't finish. Burton comes up with the rebound for the Panthers. His eyes are up ahead. He finds Elliott. Pull up triple. Connection. Bringing in Tyler. Coach Pickle doing a, a heck of a job. Ball bouncing around, ends up with Federico. Burton, nice move inside, count the basket. Yeah, they're going to reach in there. They're going to be strong. You have to go in there and be willing to finish through contact. Expect to get it. Panthers playing some stingy defense here on this possession. Matthews takes it to the rim and throws it down. Take a look at this flush. Yeah, you get in there. Don't go for no layups. <laughs> yeah, he go for the layup. Federico might get there. He just wanted to go home, see his family. But now he is back in a Mountaineer uniform where he spent the start of his collegiate career. Greg Elliott fires and hits on the other end. Panthers get their first lead of the night. And a turnover. Hinson in transition. Forward to Elliott. Another three ball. Drills it. Nike Sabandi into the game now for Pittsburgh. He loses a handle. Ball on the floor. West Virginia comes up with it. Stevenson cross court. Matthews the flush. He got four quick points for the Mountaineers. This is Joe Toussaint. Transfer from Iowa. Led them to a Big Ten title a year ago. Matthews Jr. showing he can do it on the outside as well. I think Nike was shot to be open right there, so he shot it. Toussaint playing his 100th career collegiate game. He takes the runner off the window. 13 on the timer for Pitt. Burton working on Stevenson. Goes baseline. Finds Federico. Strong off the glass. Mountaineers have made their last four from the field. Looking for five. Toussaint finds the cutter. Wagee takes it strong to the hole. 0 for 2 from the field so far tonight after dropping 27 earlier this week. This is Wagi backing down Guillermo Diaz Graham. Nice move in the post for two. Mountaineers have had the momentum most recently. They've made their last six from the field. Emmett Matthews Jr., the leading West Virginia scorer with seven. There's a drive from Wagi. Rebound was by Trey Mitchell. He's a Pittsburgh native. Went to Elizabeth Forward High School. Block called on Pittsburgh. Two leaders for Pitt on Monday. So far, the two have combined for just two points. He's got something to say. He spoke that up. He spoke that up. <laughs> the main concern is getting open and, and getting a little more fluid on your offensive sets. Santos penetrates and finishes. CDs, back when we used to use CDs still. This man, the this man. Bob Huggins didn't have gray hair back then. <laughs> <laughs> Keity Johnson working on Federico. Blocked away by Federico. 26 all. It's just over seven minutes to go in the first half. Offensive rebound and a putback for Mohamed Wagi, who's leading all Mountaineer scorers now with nine. He gives West Virginia a four-point lead at five minutes to go in the first. Coming, shook a defender. Santos corner triple. Drills it. Twelve points on three of four from beyond the arc. Both teams trying to gain some momentum before the break. Trey Mitchell starts that for the Mountaineers on the trifecta. I think it's safe to say that shooting 41 threes against West Virginia is not ideal. Cummings, what a move on the penetration and an acrobatic finish from the Pittsburgh native. Julius, how important is it to close the half on a good note? So it, the momentum is, is huge, especially against an opponent like West Virginia. And one on the other end for the Mountaineers. 
Mountaineers stretch the lead to nine. Cummings, nice move and goes to the right side for the lay-in. Pick comes out in the zone. Bob Huggins had a feeling Pitt would play multiple defenses tonight. The zone, get it in the middle. Diaz Graham too strong on the triple. Here's Tucson. Nice little pull up. Gets the roll. Remember, like you said, Elliott, he could be right out there. Kick it out to him for the three. Burton had it poked away. Defensive play by Kedrian Johnson. Transition finish. Burton working on Keedy Johnson. Slides his way into the lane. Takes the mid-range J and hits it. Foul trouble continues to plague the Panthers. Cummings sits on the bench with four. Blake Henson still in the game, but he has three. Nonetheless, that was a way. great Jensen. Play, so. Stevenson drives on Santos in the traffic and hits it. Jamarius Burton. It's the mid-range pull-up. Well-deserving. Been about 40 years since he was the head coach at Walsh College and still had guys that made the trip for the induction. Pittsburgh already dealing with a lot of foul trouble. Greg Elliott was one of the guys that was able to stay out of that. But now he makes his way off with an injury. You know, um, so I understand, but, you know, down 16 points, I kind of feel like I, don't, I wouldn't have a choice. Pitt trying to work its way back. Hinson fakes and drives. Muscles into the defender and finishes. Seven on the timer. Tucson guarded by Santos. Into the lane. Mitchell spinning and finishing. Elliott driving on Johnson. Kicks out. Cummings open three ball. Off the mark. Gets his own rebound and goes right back up. Back to his hometown, trying to will them to a win in the backyard brawl. Went to high school just 38 miles from this building. Here he is now, turnaround jumper, connects. The Panthers is daring him to shoot the jump shots. Inside, Wagee spinning and over top of the Panther defenders. Johnson guarded by Burton, over to Tucson, runner. High off the window, rims out. Offensive rebound, Wilson, back up strong, blocked by Federico. Panthers in the zone. Wilson, three-point attempt, trifecta good. Burton pushing tempo, behind the back, corner, Elliott, triple. Off the mark, West Virginia now in transition. Toussaint, what an acrobatic finish. 10 on the timer. West Virginia using it all up. Wilson spins away, finds Tucson. Jump shot good for three. Led by that guy right there, Joe Tucson, with 16 points. And his penetration has been great. They put a lot of pressure on the Panther defense. Burton loves that mid-range game. Have to watch some film, look at what you did wrong, what you could do better, what you need to improve on. Because you can expect Michigan to come with the same kind of intensity. A 23-point lead, still two minutes to go, and they're having fun. Mountaineers shot 52% up to this point. A Conquo's jam, the icing on the cake.